Uh, 90% is in the military. There's very few civilian uh, clubs rowing. Those that are is very low level. So there's not a lot of access to the, to the general population. So it's pretty much all military. Well, at the Army Rowing Node, where we train, it's at the College of Military Engineering, like uh, US Army Corps. Mm -hmm. And they built a rowing course and a training center. And so we have about 65 athletes on a consistent basis from second year rowers all the way up to international uh, level guys. Three guys competed last fall at the Asian Championships and then uh, our Olympic single scholar. The rest of, this is only their first or second 2K race ever. Some of them is their first time ever on an airplane. <laughs> yes, yeah, so they got here on Saturday to Chattanooga and had a couple days training there and then drove here today. And now they're getting a chance to, to warm up on the course and then tomorrow we start. So they love it. I think they're so excited they don't realize the jet lag. I think they're really mentally positive and so things are going well. So I'm hoping that the bodies don't crash in the middle of the week. <laughs> He qualified through the Asian qualifier at the end of April. He finished second at the Asian qualifier. And then uh, shortly after that, I was named uh, his coach because I was coaching him while he was in the Army. And so then we came to Miami on the 21st of June for a five weeks training before going to Rio. He's feeling really well, very, very good. He, he's training well. Uh, he's putting in the best times in training he's ever had. He's enjoyed himself here and he's looking forward to getting some races in. So, so far it's been very positive. They're just very excited to be able to compete. They have very little competition uh, opportunities to compete in India, and they are all Army guys, and so they are they're, they're stationed to train because they've been selected, and so that's what they do, and so they're really excited to come here and come to the United States and race in an event like this, which is just awesome and huge, and so uh, it's, we're very happy. And, um, they're always available, since there's, so there's no school, there's no home life, there's nothing, they're just in the Army. So that's been an adjustment for me, and, and it's, been a, uh, it's been nice having a group of athletes that are just 100% in rowing. <laughs> Last year, uh, US team coach is came to India, then he started, it's a different training. He changed our training schedule, uh, lots of steady state and speed work in, in a week. Every so, uh, weekend we have 1,500 meters patchwork, then it's good for us. In here, we are 10 people. In our army row node, there is more than 100 people. Mm, ergo rowing. Because I, I can see my power in my ergometer and I can concentrate on my power. I watched a lot of rowing videos before. Uh, some two guys in New Zealand from their pair. Yeah. These guys are amazing. Their rating, their rhythm, they, they're good. Also, US, uh, US countries, rowing team is good. My favorite part of our rowing is the 2K race. And this weekend, I'm, in on, I'm on a pass, lighted pass, mm -hmm. lighted post, and cox post. We are going to go for gold. And with a, I want to go home with a three golds. I started to just learn, learn, learn. And I'm learning every day. Every day, I'm learning, learning, learning new things. Rowing is a sport. Rowing is like a, you can be passionate in it. It's a sport like a, no, nothing else in other sports. It has a power, endurance, and it has an excitement. You don't know what will happen on water. <laughs>